噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔噔。What up? It's Max Mash 201. It's finally out. It's finally out. The new Star Wars trailer. So I'm gonna leave you the link down below. All right. So um, my trailer review. It's about time. I'm really looking forward to this trailer, and it's finally out. Ever since I found out that um J.J. Abrams is doing it, he did Star Trek, and it was amazing. And to find out he always wanted to do a Star Wars film, well now we finally got one. Starts out with a stormtrooper, and um you see a black stormtrooper, of course, and his name is John Boyega. So yeah, there you go. That's that actor right there. Then the next scene, it, it comes in with a, with a droid. I guess that's your comic relief droid, like this similar to R2-D2 and C-3PO. It's like, this is a goofy droid looking, um, just going across the screen. The next scene, you know, it kicks off with the stormtroopers. Now this, where you guys must be like, oh, it's supposed to be taking place like 40 years after Return of the Jedi and whatnot. Well, if you look really close to the stormtroopers, um, you'll see that they're kind of updated. Then next thing you know, the door opens and whatnot, and you can see like the new rifles. It's pretty cool. The next thing you know, you see um, a speeder scene, and that's um, I believe the actress is Daisy Ridley. Yeah. So the speeder scene is pretty interesting. You know, it looks like a, it reminds me of a Magnum ice cream bar for some reason, but whatever. The next thing you know, we got some X-wing fighters. So that's that's really badass. Um, if you look at the X-wings, they're pretty updated too. I don't know who the actor is in that in that part, but whatever. But it looks really cool. I mean, you from there you can see um JJ Abrams' touch because you see like a little lens flare in the corner. So that's pretty cool. I like that. All right, the next thing is um the Sith. All right, so you got so you see a Sith, a dark um uh a dark Jedi looking cloak wearing guy, and next thing you, know, you see his lightsaber, and this is where it comes really interesting because you see like one lightsaber laser come out then you see like two little ones come out it looks like a, it's supposed to represent like a real sword whatever but I'm not really too fond of that lightsaber I don't know why but yeah it just I don't know it's cool it's cool the settings like in a snowy scene so I don't know if that's half or whatnot but it looks pretty cool all right then, oh, we got our nostalgia coming out. So you see um, the Millennium Falcon, and I don't know who's driving it, but we all know that the old school characters are back, so I'm pretty sure Han Solo's driving that. And I believe it's driving around Tatooine. So as you can see, the Millennium Falcon, and that's in the trailer, got updated too, so that's pretty badass. I like that. And from there, you see two TIE Fighters coming in, and you know they're trying to attack the Millennium Falcon, so I guess so, and next thing you know, it cuts out to the Star Wars um, um, logo, and next thing you know, it's Force Awakens comes out, and that's about it. That was our trailer. Anyways, that's my trailer review. Please like, comment, and subscribe down below, and don't forget to like my Facebook at MaxMash201, and also follow me on Twitter and Instagram at MaxMash201. Peace!